From Paramount Studios in Hollywood, it's television's most exciting new game, Wipeout! And here to pit their knowledge and strategy against the Wipeout are... And the one who bears the best could drive off in this brand new car. And now, ladies and gentlemen, here's your host, the star of Wipeout. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. We are back once again. Hope you had a nice Merry Christmas uh, last weekend. I know I certainly did. Well, it is the end of the 2022 year, and... Uh, Let's just say we've definitely got a very nice car up for grabs here uh, that one of our players could walk away with at the end of the show. That would be a nice way to uh, end off 2022. Wouldn't you uh, think so, fellas? Yes. Most definitely. Yes. All right. And uh, our champion, uh, Justin Ray, you had a nice uh, little bit of a break last week for uh, Christmas. Did you do anything uh, exciting uh, for Christmas this year? Uh, not so much. Just, just sat back and enjoyed it. Ah. All right. And uh, Neil, uh, you've been here before, and Big Ball. Oh wait, that's the other show. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, anyways, uh, and Adam Oliver is here for a second time this season. Uh, Adam, you didn't have any luck the first time you were here, but do you think you can redeem yourself today? I can do my best. All right. Well, that's all we can hope for. Let's uh, go to work here and see what the three of you are going to be dealing with for our first board. Let's go. Oh, but actually, before we do that, uh, let's tell you about the uh, prize that you can win if you find the hotspot. It's a brand new game room worth $5,620. Pretty nice prize there. And now let's go to work and see what you're going to be dealing with for the board. All right, it happened in 2014. These are events that took place during the 2014 calendar year. So you'll, you're going to have to stretch your memory back uh, a few years for this. Justin, you're in the champion spot, so you go first. Hmm. Let's try Trudeau becomes Canada Prime Minister. No, that was a 2015 event. But no money lost on that one. Uh, Neil, you get to go for it now. Okay. Well, I can promise you I'm not going to wipe the board like I did with that one about Chevy models. <laughs> uh, let's try Winter Olympics in Russia. That one was a 2014 event. There you go. All right, and Neil, you're on the board first. All right, I'll take another crack at it. All right. Uh, let's try Germany wins World Cup. And that is correct. You're up to $750. All right, one more time. All right, he says one more. And, of course, if you find a dollar sign here, you'll double your money, but no extra spin attached. Oh, wait, that's another show. <laughs> Take your whammy and bite me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm going to try flowing water found on Mars. Okay, flowing water found on Mars. No, that is not correct. So you're down to zero, and Adam, you're up. Okay. Mmm, 2014. Yep. Um, I'll try UConn wins NCAA men's tourney. And that was a 2014 event. Very good. All 
Okay, I'll pass over to Justin. All right, Justin, we're back to you. Let's see if you can uh, find a dollar sign this time. Ebola becomes global health crisis. It did happen in 2014, and that is the hot spot prize as well. So you get a thousand dollars. You've got that game room, and twelve hundred fifty dollars for the next correct answer. Keep going or pass. I'll keep going. All right. Let's try Durant wins NBA MVP. Yes. All right, you're at twenty-two fifty. And I'll pass. All right, back over to Neil. All right, six dollar signs left and. Three wipeouts still out there. Let's try oil prices crash. The oil prices did crash in 2014. Mm -hmm. So you've got $1,500. You're in second place. I think I'm going to pass to Adam. Okay. Alright, Adam. Okay. Um, I'll try Rory McIlroy wins the British Open. Yes. And that brings you into the lead, Adam. 2500 bucks. What do you think? I will pass to Justin. Okay. Well, that shows you how confident our players are with the sport, doesn't it? <laughs> uh, Justin, your turn. Cheaters, final game. Yes, sir. Up to 42.50. And I will pass. Okay, we are back to Neil. I'm not risking that hot spot. Let's try the 7.8 magnitude earthquake in Nepal. No, I am sorry. All right, Adam, $2,500 on the line for you here. Okay. Uh, Dollar signs, two white belts. Um. Um, I'm going to go with Tom Brady involved in Deflategate. No, that is incorrect. So, Justin, you're going to have to now risk the money and that prize. But the, that's the bad news. But the good news is there's only one wipeout on the board among the remaining four answers. What was it, the Flake Gate occurred the year? Uh, the Flake Gate was 2015. One year off. Oof. I'll go Sony hacked by North Korea. There you go. All right, up to $6,500. Neil? Okay. I had a feeling that was going to happen. I'm, I'll try Eurozone Economy Falters. Okay. 2500 on the board for you. I got a pass. All right. So, Adam, you have a 50-50 shot 
You find the dollar sign, you're going to move on to the challenge round with Justin. But if you find the wipeout, it'll be Justin and Neil that go on. Oh, boy. Uh, I'll go with David Letterman with tires. So move on to the challenge round. No, I'm sorry. It's just the deal that are moving on. All right, Adam. Uh, your uh, second verse was the same as the first, apparently. But did you have fun with us anyway? Yeah, I fun and wipe out huge or dollar sign and have a merry Christmas. <laughs> Well, you're not wrong. I mean, it is still the Christmas season, but uh, perhaps we can make it a Happy New Year for one of Justin or Neil in the challenge round. round time here. Let's put away the money that uh, the two of you have won for now. And the one of you that wins this challenge round today is going to be off to Hawaii. It's a trip worth $9,204. Alright, and let's see what the two of you are dealing with. Top Seinfeld episodes of all time. We have eight of the Top 20 best Seinfeld episodes of all time is ranked by Variety. Justin, what is your bid? I got five of these. Five of them. Neil. Take it, Justin. Okay. All right, Justin, uh, five correct answers. Go for it. No soup for you. No <laughs> soup, Nazi. A very good episode. No soup for you. <laughs> Four left. The robbery. A very early episode. In fact, it was the very it was the third episode that they aired. Three to go. The contest. That's another good one. And it is correct. Two to go. The parking garage. Oh my god. Alright, one left. And the Chinese restaurant. Go. Uh, by the way, fun fact. Uh, before I see, reveal the other correct answers, here's a fun fact about that Chinese restaurant episode. Kramer was not in that one because at the time, his character never left his apartment. So that was why he was not in that episode. And that was during season two. It was season three when he started to uh, go out more. Anyway, the remaining three correct answers that we needed were the strike, the package, and the deal. And Justin, you're up one to nothing, so Neil, uh, mm -hmm. you need this next one. <clears throat> Third-person shooters, have fun. Neil, what's your bid? Mm. I'll start with four. Four of them. Justin. See if you can do it. Okay. I'll give you a Neil, shot. You gotta give four of them. All right. 
try Dead Space. Alright. Dead Space. Yes! That's one. Years of War. That's two. Halo 3. No, that is a first person shooter, so all Justin has to do is give me one correct answer, he remains the champ. Max Payne. He says Max Payne. Justin is still the champ. Good game, Neil. Good right. game. The other correct answers, Jeff Force Gemini, Contra, Kid Icarus Uprising, Fortnite, which I have ne which I am not interested in, and Crackdown. Alright, well, Justin, uh, you're still the champ. You're going to be playing for what's a very nice car here in a moment, but Neil, uh, you're going to add $2,500 more to your season total. That's not too bad. No, it's not. Hey, Justin, go get that car. All right. 20450 is what you're up to now, Neil, for the season. And, Justin, your total for the year is now $152,035. Justin, if you can win this bonus round, you'll drive out of here in an Audi S5 Sportback worth $74,583. Wouldn't that be a nice way to to end off our 2022 year? Yes, it would. All right, well, you already know how this bonus round works. Popular meat dishes is our uh, sample board, so just pick... Yeah, 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 and three, and we are going to go ahead to your actual board. Top travel destinations in 2022. As ranked by CNN. So we're looking for the top six. Well, start off with good old New York. Okay, New York. London. Los Angeles. Paris. Bye. And one more. Tokyo. Check it. All right, you have three right, nine chances left. Okay. Turn off Tokyo. Change it to Rome. It's Rome, Italy, okay? Check it. Four right. All right. Turn off Dubai. And change it to Madrid. Check it. Still four right. Okay. Turn off Madrid and Paris.
Let's put uh, Barcelona and Amsterdam on there. Check it. Three correct. Oh. Now you went backwards a little bit, but you still have six chances left. All right, turn off Barcelona and put Paris back on. And lock in. Four, five, six. Yeah, let's check it and see if it goes back up. Four right. You have five chances left. Okay. Let's see. One of these is wrong. Turn off Amsterdam. Change it to Madrid. Check it. Four right. Yeah, four for right. <coughs> oh, bless you. Thanks. Turn off Paris. Okay. And turn on Berlin. Check it. Three right. Hmm. Let's try turning off New York. And Los Angeles. Turn on Amsterdam. And Munich. All right. Check it. All right, you're back up to four, and you have two chances left. Hmm. All right. Turn off Berlin. Turn on Tokyo. Let's take a look. Four right, and this is your last chance. God, all these cities are at least top on my book. I'd love to go to some of them, but uh, which there's one definitely is a few top cities. Six? There's definitely a good amount of cities on here that I've not been to yet. So let's see. Turn off Tokyo. And 
turn off uh, Madrid. You said turn off Madrid, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Put uh, Berlin and Paris up there and we'll hope for the best. Give it a shot. For the car! No, Justin, I am sorry. All right, let's see what the correct answers were. Rome, Paris, London, Amsterdam, Madrid, and Dubai were what we needed. Mm, had Dubai and I changed it. Uh, that Madrid. was not an easy board, I'll say that. No, it wasn't. But you are still the